was the time of industrial revolution. It was somewhere around 1765 when James Watt invented the steam engine and the ultimate goal was to achieve economic leadership and therefore overall production increases, trade increases and hence the development of factories, lots of factories. But there was also a basic change in the socio-economic scene. The society was still divided, but this time on the basis of class rather than caste based. And therefore religion was losing its value. People were more into the development in transportation and how it can be more cheaper and efficient. And just after 60 years, electric railways were started in 1885, followed by underground railway in 1897. And behind this, development of communication system by the invention of telegraph in 1850 and telephone in 1876. And these two things made the industrial growth faster and faster. But this development brings some serious issues like increase in urban population, public health and safety issues, some epidemics like cholera and plagues were frequent those days. And to counter those issues, some advancements were made for public interest. Like a proper pumping water supply system in 1820 and lighting the street was made possible in 1882. But these problems are not limited to just this. And urban hygiene was a major challenge that time. There were no laws for land use, building bylaws were very unstructured and therefore haphazard development of towns and cities. And here comes the realization of importance of town and its planning. Since most of the cities were dependent on factories that time and many towns were developed around the factories which ultimately lead to the development of factory towns. In the next part we will focus on factory towns and their characteristics. I hope you enjoyed the video. See you in the next episode. Please do like, share and comments. Until then, goodbye.